Hello and welcome to another episode, or the first episode, of Matthew's Pointless Garbage. Just close your eyes. Now in today's episode, we're going to be delving into the world of cactuses. Basically, I'm going to give you five cactus facts for your information, and hopefully I'll entertain you along the way. Let's get right into it. Fact number one. Cactuses are thirsty creatures too. Inside a cactus is a nice, thick, juicy liquid, which, believe it or not, is actually water that they've stored and have been slowly consuming as they saw fit. While this water might not be as delicious as the water that you're used to drinking, it might be a bit icky. When you're stuck in a desert and you have nothing but a couple friends, one blind person, and a boomerang, oh, it's gonna seem pretty good. Suit yourself. It's very thirst quenching, though. Drink cactus juice. It'll quench you. Nothing's quench you. Uh, trust me, though, that generally speaking doesn't happen. Usually. Cactus fact number two. Cactuses is actually the correct pronunciation for the plural version of cactus. I know all you grammar Nazis are going to get up in arms and say, Actually, it's cacti. Actually, it's cacti. But in actuality, it is cactuses. Why? Because cactuses is the English pronunciation. However, cacti is the Latin pronunciation. Potato, potato, but cactuses is more correct. Grammar Nazis, hey yo. Sorry, I was confused by a double negative. You see, grammar is very important to the Nazi party. Fact number three. Cactuses produce flowers. Flowers that can actually be pollinated. Now, generally, it's pollinated by bees, uh, moths, butterflies, hummingbirds, and bats. But you can pollinate them by hand, if you so please. Get like a Q-tip or something. Roll a clip. That was really something special. Moving right along. Fact number four. Cactuses are one of the only plants to have spines. Yet what are these spines used for, Matthew? Well, they're used to protect the cactus and to ward off predators. But what you don't know is that they're also used to prevent water loss from evaporation. Essentially what it is is it's a bunch of corks in a bottle. However, these corks are extremely sharp and it would hurt your hand to touch them, but if you touch the wine cork, then I'm sure you'd be just fine. Am I right or am I right? I'm right. Roll the clip. I'm Coyote Peterson. Get ready for a very special Behind the Adventure. Ow. <laughs> that one definitely hurt. Fact number five. <laughs> Cactuses live for a very, very long time. While a handful of household cactuses may only live up to 15 years, some of the bigger cactuses that can get up to 4,500 pounds would live up to 300 years. Which means that there is still a pre-revolutionary cactus alive to this day, and mark my words, I will find it, and I will end it. But that does signify the end of the episode because my glasses did break, and that's all I have. Please like if you enjoyed the video, subscribe for more great content, Thank you for watching. Love you guys. Nah, 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 nah,